So one of the labs I'll highlight is my testosterone labs. People have always been curious about, oh, Dr. Baker, your testosterone was low on one test three or four years ago. And my God, you're a, you're an old frail guy, right? Which is obviously clear, clearly BS. Clearly, I'm stronger than 99.9% .9 of guys my age. You know, I'm almost 55. You know, I'm here repping deadlifts, pound, deadlifts with 500 pounds, you know. I'm 240 pounds, you know, lean, uh, muscular. So latest update on labs. Uh, so my overall testosterone was 450. Um, and my free testosterone was something like 50 or 51. So anyway, they, here they are here. Um, what did I do different? Nothing. Here's the deal. Your testosterone labs vary every single day. Depends what time of the day you get them. It depends what time, you know, what's been going on recently. It is, you know, again, and there's also the, the fact that receptors interact with it. So, the, so 450 is not super high, it's certainly not super low. It's kind of mid-range. It's nothing, you know, honestly, I could care less. You know, it is just a, uh, uh, you know, what's important is what you're doing clinically, functionally, how strong you are, how much muscle you carry, what your sexual function is like. All of those things I can tell you in my case are very, very good. Um, so... Yeah, you know, I'll update the rest of the labs as good. maybe as the week goes on. I've got, I think about 10, 10 lab systems, you know, uh, you know, pretty un, uninteresting for the most part. Uh, there's a couple that I'll point out that, that, that uh, are interesting though. So you guys have, so anyway, testosterone level pretty much in the normal range. Yes! I know a lot of y'all are gonna disagree with me, but I've been saying since the jump that Dr. Baker is natty and you guys can go back and check out my Dr. Sean Baker, Natty or Not video here on YouTube by clicking on the thumbnail that pops up right now.